hottest days ever and waiting for a train that never exists. Is this the right train? I hope it does. Probably my most favorite things to do in Bangkok is to go in to a shopping mall and get some AC. Yeah, it's quite big. This does look nice. I must say I'm impressed. Just a little small local market. So our plan for today is just to go to the park and find a spot to eat something and chill up, I guess, just to chill. It's my day off anyway. Look at how brown and dry this is. I swear, this is still summer. It's not awesome. so dry. The draw is scary. Oh dear. I don't know how else to entertain myself while walking in a very dryness and heat than talking. Um, but apparently we are now in Kingston and walking around Bushy Park. And it's kind of like it, like the train schedule was pretty confusing because of, I don't know, I think because of the strike which happened this week and will continue until next week. And also because of this heat wave and today is probably one of the hottest day. I think it's currently it's now like 32 degree and you can already like see how dry and bright it is. I feel like well, the first heat wave, people will be like, "Oh, okay, cool." Like it's really hot. Oh, but then this time we're just like, "Oh, we can't. We're so fed up with the heat." And this country is not made for heat or any kind of weather. So yeah, I think we're now pretty like fed up with it. Um. So and then at the same time, you really think about it. We haven't had rain, like proper, like proper rain for a long time and I felt, I mean, I feel quite disoriented to see it like this. Um, so, you know, we, it's just funny how we all just hope that we will we'll get some rain soon and let's just hope like this heat will go away. But, you know, what else can we do? Global warming is real. As we all know, but we don't know how to fix it. We try, but it is what it is, I guess. Okay, let's see if I survive and if we can actually find some seat to sit down and eat something. Or else I'll just melt into the ground. I wish you all could hear how dry the grass is, it's just like all the time. You can see like all the deer wildlife just roam freely in this park but it's actually like you should not feed them because then otherwise it will change your consuming behavior so even if you see deer like that you can't and should not like fear them or like do anything or like approach them. Mm. Now we have entered to another section of this park. Definitely greener and more wildlife. Ooh, duck. Another duck. To cream. Yes. 
pizza. Do they do takeaway at all? Oh wow, look at that bunny. Can you see that? Ooh, dig, 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 dig. One's here. And then there's another over there. And another over there. There's imposter among us. Meanwhile, pigeons wooing another female pigeon. And the crow just go. We're now sort of walking back. Ah, there's just a lot of insects around here. What the hell? <laughs> so we're just now walking back because there's nothing else to do. It's pretty dry and we had nice ice cream and that's that see see how dry this is so i guess i'll just finish this clip with me walking in the dry the same way as i did this whole trip it's not even a trip because it's not really actually like far away from london but anyway, I'm not saying that Kingston, Kingston or this part is not bad. I think we just came at the wrong time. So, yeah, I guess I'll see you all next clip or next one day trip. And in the meantime, please stay hydrated, stay healthy, stay fit. See you. Bye bye. Oh. I know that you're teasing me. You just keep teasing me about me doing YouTube and talk to myself. Even say bye bye in my high pitched voice. I know you're teasing me. I'm not letting you go. I'll put this one minute long of you on walking away from me. Oh, look at that. Is that mushroom? Are those mushroom? Maybe not. I'm not letting you get away with this. I'm not letting you get away with this.